everyone, welcome to today's video. It is a Tesco grocery haul. If you like this video, please do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more. And don't forget to hit the notification bell that will notify you when I upload a new video. So we have some hot and spicy chicken mini fillets for our tea tonight. These are just really nice. We're going to have these with the breaded chicken pops and we've got some beans to have with it for me and Shu. And Izzy and Thomas picked these breaded chicken goujons so the kids are going to have those with some chips and some beans. We have got some Tesco mayonnaise, some ham for sandwiches, some mushrooms, I've got the closed cup ones to put in a spaghetti bolognese, some double cream, some baby jersey potatoes to have with some gammon for the children. We have got some small bananas. These are great for the kids as they are perfect size, especially for Edward and for lunch boxes. Some strawberries to have with the cream. I've got a Weight Watchers chicken tikka masala meal. These are really nice and I have these on a Wednesday before I go to work as I have to have my lunch before I go to work because I start at lunchtime and I'm not back in the house till about 7 p.m. because that just keeps me full. We've got some bird's eye hot and spicy chicken in bread, crumb, bread crumbs fillets. These are for me and Stu to have in some wraps with salad later in the week. The kids picked these up, Miss Molly's Raspberry Ripple Mousses. I thought these were a nice treat for after tea, especially with the hot weather and they can all enjoy one of those. We got some barbecue Heinz beans to have with the chicken and the chips. Some tuna to have some tuna pasta. And the kids wanted normal beans and not barbecue beans. Then me and Stu have got these to try. Miss Molly Strawberry Trifles. These were about 90p. And you get two. They were 56p actually these ones. These were the ones that were 90p that Izzy picked. They're like the caramel puddings. I used to have these as a child. And you tip them over and they're like a little creme brulee dessert. We've got some garlic bread to have with the spaghetti bolognese. Then Stu noticed these. Bomberman jam is one of my absolute favourites. And he saw these Bomberman dark chocolate creme with a touch of sea salt. And these were reduced to 75p for two. And they are, I wouldn't have paid £1.50 for them, I don't think. As they are pretty small. There they are. They are pretty small. So we're going to have these for after our tea today. As they go off today. Some yogurts for Edward, the 90p for all these, they're just really nice for him. And then we've got some of these, we've had them before. These were in the reduced section, they are really nice chips, they cook really nice and they are just nice to have. So we're going to have these with the chicken, they're the sea salt and cracked black pepper. They also do paprika fries in this range as well, they're McCain's. Then the kids have picked pizza. They are having pepperoni for Thomas and cheese and tomato for Izzy. And then I'm not going to lift it, but in the corner there, in the background there, we have 24 cans of Diet Coke and they were £6.50. So that should last us a while. Then we got six British medium free range eggs as Edward really loves scrambled eggs and omelette and they're just good to have in the house. The kids wanted these iced finger buns so they've got those and they were down to 44 pence. 
I'm obsessed, I love this. It's Tesco Ice Madeira Cake and it's got buttercream and a raspberry jam layer. And I just love Madeira Cake. It's nice to have in an evening as a little snack after tea or just, well, it's always a good thing to have cake in the house. I think I must just take after my grandma as she always used to have cake in the house. Then Izzy saw these and they're ba ba Balison Zoo Original Butter Biscuits and these were reduced down to 50p in the biscuit aisle and I just thought they were a nice resealable packet and they'd be good if we go on a day out or anything at the weekend and we can just give them a few and reseal it back up. Thomas saw these, Mr Kipling, James Peaches and Cream Slices and they're going to try these and they can take them in their lunchbox as they come in, oh, come in little individual packets for them to put in their lunchboxes. To be honest, I think he was swayed by the cute Royal Doll drawings. Then we got some Tesco cream crackers. I thought these would be good for Edward as last week he had a dip it which is Aldi version of a Derrily Dunker uh, with his with cream cheese in and he always has cream cheese on his sandwich so I thought crackers and cream cheese would be a nice different lunch for him than what he normally has. Some Heinz apple biscottis as they're his favourites. He's already had one while he was waiting for us to pack up the shopping at the checkout. Some Tesco pikelets as he really likes these for his breakfast. We've got eight pork sausages as the kids are going to have sausage and mash for tea one night. Some gammon for Thomas and Izzy to have with the new potatoes. Two beef mincers to make spaghetti bolognese. Some organics, finger food carrot sticks. These are Edward's favourites. We've got some Alberta balsam sunkiss raspberry conditioner for mine and Izzy's hair. Some PG tips, 200 tea bags for stew. I don't actually, and visitors, I don't actually drink tea. But these were on offer and Stu said they were good value so he got those. Uh, so mini cheddars for Thomas's lunch, those were his pick. Me and Stu have got some salt and vinegar oven baked walkers. Although I've not really been eating Chris a lot at the minute. But Stu takes a packet to work and they're just nice to have in if I fancy some Chris. Izzy picked bunny bites, which are basically pom bears, but bunnies. Some Tesco Everyday Value squash. I have been having cherries and berries lately, but I just picked this one up as I've gone off cherries and berries. Then we've treated ourselves to some fever tree aromatic tonic water, as this is just lovely with our Edinburgh rhubarb and ginger gin and even just to drink on its own it's just a really nice flavour to it so this was 185 and it's well worth it then the kids have got into this it's basically Tesco's version of the Vimpto but it's called Physio and it's Physio Zero so they have a cup of that sometimes and then we've got some little wraps for them to have with their lunches for school. And we've got some bigger wraps for our lunches and for when we have chicken to put with our chicken and salad wraps. As these are better for fitting all the filling in. Whereas we had the use the little ones this week when we had the same meal. And all the filling kept falling out as the two little to wrap over. 
So I hope you have enjoyed the grocery haul. That grocery haul came to £60.60p and it should do us for most of the week. We do need to go and get a few more meals um, but we have a few bits in the freezer as well. We're trying to use up all our stock in the freezer and the cupboards. Just try and wind everything down and then we can go do a big freezer shot probably to Iceland or somewhere like that. So I hope you have enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!